Hello there, everybody. Looney Farm Guy here with a new mod test for Wednesday, April 13th. And the Auto Load IT Runner Platform by ER Shaba, uh, 3.77 megabytes uh, to download, and four slots, uh, four and five slots, four slots for um, the pallet auto loader IT and four, five slots uh, for the first one of the liquids. Now there's quite a bit going on here. I'm going to try to go through it um, systematically one by one. So first of all, where do you find it? Tools and miscellaneous. That's where you will find them. Uh, oh, here it is. The IT runner auto load platform for factory pallets and the drum platform. $3,600 for the pallet one. It will hold 34,000 liters of all those things you see down there. So pretty much anything that comes from a production facility. Now, um, the drum platform will only hold uh, those five items uh, at 13,500 liters. Uh, that's the one that uh, will be five slots. So let's look at the uh, auto load for pallets first. Now this one, you don't have to choose which one it, which one it is. It's it's, it's a standard, um, kind of like all the auto load pallet things, uh, pallet trailers. <clears throat> um, you can choose a color. Uh, there's a few, not every color. Um, you know, just a, a uh, limited number of colors, but they're pretty nice. Uh, oh, colors, yes. How much will the colors cost you? A thousand bucks for the, uh, to choose your color. Now, um, let's talk about that one first. Um, no, <laughs> let's look at both of them in the store because <laughs> like I say there's, it's, it's a, mm, we're, we're going to talk. Yes. Okay. So this one. This is the drum platform. We'll, we'll look at this one first because you have your choice between liquid fertilizer, herbicide, diesel, water, silage additive, right? And back to liquid fertilizer. Then again, you have your same color choices, whatever you like. So picking one of those, those are that's the only thing it's going to carry. Uh, with the color, without the color, we'll just go back to brown. Now, if you notice, it'll put a little label on the front, silage of uh, liquid fertilizer so that you know what it is. You're not guessing, right? Herbicide, diesel, water. And then, uh, you know, you can change the color according to, say, that one, the uh, silage additive, make it green so it matches, so you know. So at least there's some color options. Now, as you can see here, this is the uh, Tatra ITR460. That is in vehicles. It is a mod. You will need to download at least one of three mods to use this. The Phoenix IT Runner Edition. Uh, that will work with these. Also, this is the Roland Ampi Roll. Comes in the Roland Pack. The Roland Pack is going to be... Uh, you'll find those under Trailers. And that comes with um, a trailer, a Roland pack. There it is, the Ampi Roll, 71,000 for that. You have to, the Roland pack is a pack of, of IT tile type style runner and some trailers. So it's nice. Uh, when picking the Roland, you must choose under attacher compatibility IT runner for it to work properly on the Roland Ampi Roll 7526. Now, there is one other um, trailer that will work. This is fairly recent. Also under trailers, it is a pack, an IT runner pack. And this is the Multi Fruit Container XL. That comes with the Lizard Logistics 2333 HD. It's an IT runner trailer, $35,000 for that. And that uh, will work. It is an IT runner trailer. Uh, they don't, you don't, there's color options. You don't have to worry about using this. It will work 
with that as well. Now, the pallet loading uh, IT runner. Now, in order to load pallets, as you can see, I have some furniture on here. Uh, if you just drive up beside the stuff, it's not going to load. In order to load the pallets onto the IT runner platform, you have to unload the IT runner like so by pressing uh, L1 and X and it will drop it but it will stay attached as you can see and you can move it around so in order to get it close you'd want to get it as close as possible but you can move it around kind of like a trailer and there you go you see it's starting to pick stuff up It'll only pick up one kind at a time. Be careful when you have less than 5% of, of an item because it will delete that if you go buy another item and it'll start picking that up instead. Right, so once, it's, once you have it all loaded up, L1 and X and it will reload. Furniture being heavy, it's quite heavy. I do love this truck, though. It is an awesome truck. Uh, if you and and to sell it, you don't have to you don't have to unload it. Selling it, all you have to do is drive over top of a cell um, location, and it will sell it. You don't have to unload it or do anything. Automatically sells for you. Not the fastest, but very convenient. Uh, does it have straps? No straps doesn't need it because it's an auto load it's like kind of there but not there and there it is now this will hold um, as we could see we'll go back and look at it just look at it again because it holds doesn't hold every single thing that you can find on a pallet but all the productions and uh, yeah so if we go Let's just, for fun, go under the buy anything. Uh, you can get grapes, eggs, wool. Uh, we'll take wool. Tree saplings, flour, bread, cake. Be careful with the tree saplings. I've had problem with that before. Uh, bread, cake, butter, cheese, fabric, clothes, sugar, cereal, sunflower oil, 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 raisins, grape juice, lettuce, tomatoes, strawberries, chocolate, planks, furniture. Back to grapes. Um, and, uh, if you want to be a little bit, mm, um, oh, no, oh, there it is. <laughs> um, yeah, you can get, you can get free stuff out of the A2 studio. It won't charge you for a full load of anything. I've tried it with furniture and bread. <laughs> um, so that's kind of neat <laughs> and then go and sell it again yeah i don't know why it doesn't charge kind of it's like did it freeze and then all of a sudden it fills up totally and it's like oops anyways so there <laughs> um and then as again uh if you want to unload it if it's something that can is unloadable on uh there we go we've unloaded It'll unload out the back like so. Right. Okay, now. <laughs> on to the liquid one. The liquid one's interesting. Um, um, this one, uh, we have filled with water. Now, uh, the one with the trailer is, of course, you have to... Uh, be, you know, make sure you're, you're clicked on the right... Um, the right one now now water won't unload anywhere because water doesn't you can't get water on pallets at least not yet or not in a base game type pallet or production water isn't produced on a pallet so you can sell it from here as you can see there it's being sold uh, or or you can go up to something that takes water uh, animals or something or whatever uh, and then you can fill it up 
but uh, the water is a trick. The water is basically like a water tank. You can treat it like a um, a tanker. That's pretty much um, how that one works. Now, uh, herbicide, on the other hand, or liquid fertilizer. This one is herbicide. Um, now it's interesting because, uh, whoops, um, there we go. Unload it. Uh, herbicide comes in um, IBS containers from the store, and they will appear as that uh, when it's. Uh... Now let's see here. They should be picking this up. Oh, yeah. Load honk. Uh. That's odd. Should be picking it up. Oh, L3, refill. There we go. Okay, then you got to press the... Uh, oh, that's right. Okay, I remember. Sorry. <laughs> uh, it's like a tanker. Uh, you have to press the uh, refill button. It won't automatically load it. There we go. L3 refill. Uh, and then it will load. But you'd still have to uh, lower the platform to the ground. And as you can see, it will it, uh, it puts it in barrels on there. But it doesn't unload it to barrels. It's a little tricky. There we go. A little tricky backing up because now it's acting like a, a dual trailer. But uh, when you're done uh, filling, just uh, press the uh, X button to load it back up on the trailer. And just like the other ones, you don't need to unload it to sell it. There we go. Um, yeah, so a uh, pretty. Will it let me fill it? Oh, you know what? You don't have to lower it. Oh, look at that. Oh, so you don't have to lower it to fill it. You just have to press the L3 button to load it. That's so much easier. Um, so uh, just to show you, this is silage additive. It'll show. It'll appear like that. But if we go like that, it'll refill it. Should, yeah, re... Oh, it's refill so slowly from these. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Just beware of that. Uh, those little... Uh, these little guys refill. It's like you're opening each little can and dumping it into there. <laughs> Right. Okay. So just beware when you're unloading those silage. You would never use that much anyways, silage additive. Um, the, the vehicles uh, barely use any. 20 liters can last you like two or three years in a, a silage um, forage wagon. So um, anyways, I'm kind of going on and on here. But very interesting. We're getting some interesting, very interesting... Uh, auto loading type um, trailers and this is the IT runner pack very interesting some color choices um, yeah so hopefully that kind of shows I, I didn't show every single item um, it may not work for some but it looks like most of them it will work for so uh, if you like the IT runner style of um, uh, trailers and so forth, uh, this is pretty uh, versatile. Uh, this is the Autoload IT Runner platform by ER Shaba, 3.77 megabytes to download, and four slots and five slots on console. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game. 
Uh, so, well, have fun with these auto-load uh, IT runner platforms, trailers, thingies. <laughs> Till next time, bye for now.